two leaders with only their surname in common, one leading the new National Party and the other the National Democratic Congress, one continuing with the regular kind of leadership and one a new face with new ideas and ideologies. Top analysts probed the then and now of general elections, the campaign and the outcome on Monday nights beyond the headlines. Dr. Wendy Grenade, senior lecturer in political science at the University of the West Indies, believes the NDC's success is because they ran a very good campaign despite having a relatively new slate of candidates. I think for the first time I, I saw a political campaign that focused predominantly on issues. Mm -hmm. And I think that captivated many, many persons. Um, the, 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 the social media campaign, um, it was quite dynamic. And it was, it was refreshing, um, a kind of techno-democracy that I think people yearned for something different. A key component of the discussion was the overwhelming support the National Democratic Congress received from the nation's youth. With the new National Party's implementation of the Imani program, with thousands signed up to that initiative, many assumed that this would be an instant push towards the incumbent. But this was not the realization at the polls. It is believed that the NDC and its political leader spoke to the real issues affecting young people and that he provided the hope they so longed for. Young people were looking at the television and seeing somebody saying to them, you could become more. Poverty mustn't be a natural state. You, 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 can, you can get a skill, you know? And, and I think as we go forward, thinking about the next 50 years of independence, we must want a new kind of society. And this is an opportunity to reimagine a new Grenada, and not just to reimagine it, but to make it happen. But it must be a collective effort. With the COVID-19 pandemic, the invasion of Ukraine by Russia, and the fallout from this on the world market, leading to high costs of living, many people see the NDC governing in a time of difficulties. Dr. Grenade believes that there is an opportunity to use the present crises and ask what opportunities can be derived from them. I think it's a brilliant opportunity for us to ride the crises, look for opportunities, be creative, be innovative, do things better. And I'm, I'm hopeful and I'm confident. She says what has to be done is that the expectation of citizens have to be managed. Dr. Grenade is also satisfied that the country now has an opposition which serves well for democracy. But for the future of the new national party, Dr. Grenade believes that succession planning will determine the way forward for the party. Cherry and Blackman Stephen, GBN News.